Yo, bro. Yo, bro. <laughs> Dude. 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 What's up, guys? I'm Chris. I'm Virgo, and welcome to our lives. So we asked you guys to ask us a couple questions. We're gonna answer them right now. <clears throat> are you ready? Let's do it. What are your horoscope signs and do you take horoscopes seriously? I'm a Sagittarius. Do you take it seriously? Yeah. I'm a Gemini. I used to, but not anymore. Let me read yours. Sagittarius. Keep doing what you're doing and you will end up with 12 cats in a house when you're <laughs> 17. Did you just make that up? She <laughs> in her nose. If I ended up in a house with how many cats did you say? 12? <laughs> I would die, I'm allergic. I would never be in a house with 12 cats. That's why you shouldn't trust horoscopes. <laughs> but like if I read Sagittarius things, I am 100% Sagittarius. Oh no, I was reading that 100%. Like, yeah, because you're 100% a Gemini. <laughs> How did you two meet? Dun, dun, dun. So one day, I was in Miami, like three months ago or so. Three months ago? <laughs> I know it feels like it's That's longer. we started our YouTube channel. <laughs> Really good. Just a regular day. Regular day. I was on Tinder and you know I was swiping left. You know one of those days where you're like swipe left and then this beautiful face pops up. I was like, damn, damn. I read her bio and it says, <laughs> what does my bio say? <laughs> if you're Spanish with freckles, swipe right. <laughs> I swipe right. Then I was on Tinder swiping right to everybody. I'm like Virgo. <laughs> I always swipe right. I always swipe right. <laughs> I saw Virgo. I was like, mm, I don't know. Really? But wow. yeah, really. Then I read her bio. <laughs> What did my bio say? Your bio said, I love Colombian girls. <laughs> if you're Colombian and you like hummus, hit me up. <laughs> That's me. I'm Colombian and I love hummus. <laughs> and I like swipe right. right. And we match. Yeah, thanks guys. <laughs> I don't know where that was going. <sighs> guys, we met three years ago in a motel in Miami because Sam was visiting Virgo. She told me to come to her hotel to hang out. And now yeah. we are best friends forever. Okay, wait, what? Of the people in this room, who would you feel most comfortable with naked? What people? We're the only ones here! If you could only see the world in one color, what color would it be? Is yours yellow? Because your favorite color is yellow. Oh, that could be cool. I feel like I would say it in yellow because I feel like it's happy. Like sun. Look. <laughs> oh, that's so. I probably wouldn't do like dark colors. What if you saw everything black? What are you I can't see anything, <laughs> dude. Are you dude, where are you? <laughs> is this you? <laughs> dude, <laughs> what's the first thing you'd do if you woke up one day and you were the opposite sex? I would probably like walk Put around naked, <laughs> swing my dick everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> like I don't know what it's like to have that in between your legs. <laughs> so that's probably what I would do for the first like 30 to an hour of me being a guy. What's one thing you and Virgo haven't told each other? Uh, I think we tell each other everything. Or is there something you haven't told me? Wait, what was your first impression of each other? I thought you were really shy. I am really shy. Wait, what was your first impression, like first impression of each other when we actually became good friends? Oh, I was like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know when the, like that one sound plays and you, yeah, you like, make eye you contact. make eye contact with someone and they're like going just as hard as you? That's probably yeah. the feeling we got. That was a fun night. She's dope. I had so much fun that night. That was yeah, that was probably one of my favorite nights ever. What's the funniest encounter you've ever had with a straight girl? Like that girl. From the bar. Oh, <laughs> it was just so weird. Okay, we have to tell them the story. Okay, so we were at this bar, and like me and Virgo have complete opposite tastes. If she thinks someone's attractive, I'll be like, nah. And then if I say someone's attractive, Virgo will be like, nah. <laughs> this is the first time we have ever both thought someone was attractive, like on another level. It was we were at the bar, and it was like a waitress or bartender or whatever, and she was walking by. And every time she would walk by, we would just like sit at her. <laughs> but this one time, like all jokes aside. We were both standing like against the Yeah, wall. we were both standing like against like this bar type thing. And she just started walking by us this close to us. Like, and we were like, oh my god. Slow motion, everything. Slow motion. Out of nowhere, a spotlight. A I'm spotlight. not I'm kidding. Boom, on her face. And then there's a fan. And then there's a fan right in that same corner. And the fan just like hits her. <laughs> like a Crazy. Beyonce moment. Crazy. And then me and Bro were just like, <sighs> and we were so taken back that me and Bro just melted and sat on the floor of the bar. Like we literally were just like, we looked at each other and I was like, did you see that? Virgo was like, yeah. It like, just happened. One of those moments where you think it just happened in your head, but it actually happened in real life and we both saw it. 
It was crazy. What the heck? Like it was so bad. If you could wear one color for the rest of your life, what would it be? Black. Black. Describe each other in three words. Fun. Okay. Big hearted and loyal. Ooh. Nice. Yours are secretly funny. You make those like little secret jokes that only I get. You're very balanced. You like balance your emotions really well. And you're very, you're like a caregiver. Yeah. Like that's what you are. You're very like caring. Mm -hmm. Favorite physical thing of each other? Well, I just love your face. <laughs> <laughs> like your eyebrows, your lips, your eyes are sick. Um, I was in and you guys can't see it from the camera, but I can see it from here. Every night we go out, someone compliments every time her eyebrows and her lips. So bright. Another physical thing about you, obviously freckles. I feel like your eyes are really expressive. But like your eyes and your freckles, like right here. Yeah. Thanks. Mm -hmm. What's your favorite thing about your friendship? That we're never bored. Also, if I'm having a bad day, I feel like you can tell, but like you'll never be like, you want to talk about it because you know I don't like to talk about my feelings. Yeah, I'll just cheer you So up. you'll just be like, hey, let's go to the beach and we'll go to the beach and like literally just sit there yeah. and not talk. We're like, not very open about our emotions. Yeah. At all. We're very like in sync. Really? Totally. totally. Yo! <laughs> that is so funny. That was really weird. Butts or boobs? Butts. 100% butts. <laughs> Are you guys secretly dating? <laughs> if you were stuck in an island and could only bring three things, what would they be? What do you think my three things would be? Makeup, music, and arepa. I didn't even think of that myself, but I would! But I wouldn't bring makeup. Like, I only care about makeup when it comes to my eyebrows. Oh. I would bring like... Music, arepa, and brio. Ah! Popcorn, a soccer ball. No, Toby. 100%. 100%. If we combine our three things and we go together to the island. Music. Arepas. Toby. Toby. And our camera to vlog it. And then the Wi-Fi is <laughs> And then the computer so we can vlog. Is that sick? Yeah. Okay, would you rather be the first person to explore a planet or the inventor of a drug that cures a deadly disease? I would cure a disease. I don't think I could explore a planet by myself. I feel like the consequences of exploring a new planet come along with never coming back to Earth. No, maybe you could come back. It's too far. You don't know that. Maybe you, you get could, here and then you find the love of your life on the other side and you will never meet. Because you will never love your life because you're the only one on the planet! <laughs> Literally, there could be an animal, you wouldn't even get to explore the planet because you got killed the first thing. They ate you. <laughs> yeah, that makes sense. I go with that. What are each other's type? Me and Virgo have complete opposite types. Yeah. Virgo likes like blonde surfer. <laughs> so yeah, basically. What do I like? He loves bitchy girls. He likes girls that are on top. I like of her. brunettes. Oh, yeah, hi, brunettes. We need to take one second for brunettes. Hispanic girls. True. Like feisty and witty and like they get my humor and they emotionally abuse me. Love it! <laughs> How do you say banana in Spanish? Banana. Platano. You guys just pulled the trigger. No. Platano. No. We're not doing this right now. We're not doing this. There's not enough time. Platano. No. Banano. Banano. Every time this comes out, we have a, we have an argument. Platano is like a different thing. No. Yeah. Banano. Platano. Banano is like the yellow one, like the fruit. Like the green one, like a plantain. Like in English, banana, plantain. Okay, no, tío. Platano. 100%. 100%. Platano grande, platano pequeño, platano todo. That makes no... It makes way more sense to be like banana platano. What do you call the baby bananas then? Platanito. Small. It's even smaller <laughs> bananas. Platanito. I don't even like bananas. How do you say pool? Like a swimming pool? Yeah. Piscina. Okay. How do you say piscina? Piscina. Piscina. So guys, this was our Q&A video. We didn't get to do all the questions, so we'll probably do another Q&A another time. But we hope you enjoyed it. So if you enjoyed watching our lives as much as we enjoyed loving them, and don't forget to follow us on our social media. And don't forget to pin it, retweet it, reblog it, and swipe right. The standout comment of this week is... I'm from Mexico and the wall isn't stopping me from going to see you. <laughs> Thank you, Natalia. And if you want to shout out on next week's video, give us a standout comment on this video. And yeah, That's you, it, right? what is this banana doing? Where? Oh wait, get them off. Oh, this one? Dude, no, take that one off, dude. Oh, no, screw it over, screw it over. <laughs> Dude, what are these? All these bananas. Dude, Take them what out. is this? Bring them out. Take them out. <laughs> Bye, guys. Bye, guys.
Wow. Oh, wow, that was really good.